So all these people on Facebook started to look in their, at their ballots because people had started receiving them yesterday in my neighborhood and everybody's was wrong. And then not only were people's addresses and names wrong, but on the ballot itself, it says um, official absentee military ballot. And I can show you military ballot. It's supposed to have a slash between absentee and military. So absentee and or military, but because there's not a slash there, it makes, when you read it, you think that you got a military ballot. You open it, you have your ballot. Hi, I'm not in the military, although I appreciate them. Then you have this envelope, which is the outer envelope that you mail everything back in that goes to the Board of Elections. That's correct. And then this is the security envelope. It has a different name, a different barcode, and her voter ID. And then on the back is where you sign it. So if I signed my name on that, it would not be the same name as the woman whose security envelope this is. It's infuriating. It's infuriating. It's for this election where the sheer number of people requesting absentee ballots, which of course will far surpass, surpass any other election we've had because of the pandemic. And because of this, it will force people to, to vote in person during a pandemic when they did not feel safe doing so. Um, I'm furious, I'm furious. I hate that I have to make that choice.